Weather with Chief Meteorologist Matt Miller. Tonight, temperatures will fall back down into the 60s once again. Even some 50s in the northwestern counties where the air is cooler. But we have another chance for thunderstorms to develop during the second half of the night and on into early tomorrow morning. Showers and a few thunderstorms will produce some uh, areas of uh, rain. Uh, well, I don't know why that extra L decided to jump into the early thunderstorms for tomorrow. But then we'll be warming up as we head into the daytime Wednesday and then drier air will start to return Wednesday, Thursday on into Friday as well. Right now, a mainly cloudy sky at Emporia. Notice the clouds though off to the south and east from Junction City, but up overhead some sunshine and clearly a, a nice start to the evening in Junction City. Cloudy sky currently in Topeka. Had the rain this morning, but it's been dry ever since. Temperatures held down though 75 degrees with an east northeast wind at eight miles per hour. 79 has been the high so far in Topeka after starting out in the upper 60s. That came with the rain early on this morning. So warmer than average on the low, noticeably cooler than average for the high. Some of the northwestern counties have been up still around 80 degrees. Concordia right at 80, Marysville 79, low to mid 70s to the south and east, but that's also where the humidity is higher. There's a front draped right across the area. On one side, dew points are very comfortably dry in the 50s and then upper 60s to the south and east of the turnpike. Shows up even more when you look statewide and really all across the region. That front stalled out will become the focus as our next storm system approaches to kind of fuel that boundary with showers and thunderstorms. That'll happen tonight. The humidity will lift northward during the day tomorrow, and then it'll turn around and get pushed back to the south, especially through the daytime on Wednesday. We'll start to dry out once again. So comfortable air will be making a return. I'll have to watch for a few isolated showers this evening. That will not be the main round of rain by any stretch. We're watching a bigger disturbance out to the west, creating numerous showers over the Rockies. See that dipping down to the blue lines? That storm system's approaching. It'll funnel in the moisture over the area, help to provide all of the ingredients needed to form those showers and thunderstorms. And we expect this to happen with the clouds thickening by midnight. After midnight into the morning, showers and a few thunderstorms will start to break out. I think we'll see them just kind of scattered around the region and then maybe a few more showers during the early part of the day tomorrow. But as the day goes on, we're kind of stuck with a lot of cloud cover through the day tomorrow and then tomorrow night we clear maybe some patchy fog Wednesday morning and then lots of sunshine for the rest of the day on Wednesday. And that's when we start to get into that drier air, that warmer afternoon weather and cooler nights set up. We'll be back with us as we head toward the tail end of the week. Tonight down to 64 and then back up to 79, mostly cloudy tomorrow. Best chance for showers and thunderstorms late tonight and for the first few hours of the daytime on your Tuesday. After that, we clear out on Wednesday, back up to a sunny high temperature around 85, 86 on Thursday. And then another cold front comes in and that'll bring in cooler, drier air for Friday. Very pleasant Friday, upper 70s with sunshine. We warm up again Saturday and right now it looks like our next front comes in halfway through the day on Sunday. Now that will be a little bit problemsome, nailing down exactly what the high temperature will be. But upper 70s to about 80 with the rain developing and then much cooler. Notice that 49 degree start to Monday morning could see several cool days early next week. We didn't get a lot of thunderstorms in Topeka this morning. It's a few showers, but it was a little stormier over at Kansas City. That photo sent to us from Jay Schmidt. I was going to say, I was like, that is not Topeka. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Topeka grew overnight. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we, we, <laughs> that was obviously sent in from a viewer over in the Kansas City area this morning. Yeah, a lot of, uh, lot of rain this morning. Lots. But yeah. it's cooler, so we like that. Yeah. And the grass looks a little greener today, so yeah. that's nice.